Hello, it's Steve again from the Car Key Man. Thanks for joining us. Today we've got a key for an Alfa Romeo. Okay, and this one's off a of Mito. It's a three button key, unlock, lock, and boot. And they're really expensive, these keys from the dealer, so take care of them. Uh, okay, so it's a really simple job on how to change the key battery because this key really is just like a Fiat key for a Ducato van or a Fiat Punto, same key really. But uh, it looks a bit different. So you've got a screw here. This screw, it's kind of got a little flat on it there. And there's two things it points to. I'll zoom in. You've either got the lock. Uh, let's have a look. You've got the lock there. Or the unlock here. And at the moment, the battery's held tight. So it's pointing to the lock. So what we're going to do is... Stick a screwdriver in there and just give it a twist around just a quarter turn to the unlock. Okay. So now, oh, it's almost done. Can you go a bit more? There you go, that's better. So now you can see that the screw there is pointing to the unlock, the little slot. Okay, and once that's done, if you pop it around, you will be able to pop your thing in there and that just lifts off okay and pulls out okay as you pull it out pop the key to one side and then before you take the battery out just have a look at what it looks like so when you take this out before you move the battery just make a note of what you can see. So you can, on the bit where the writing is here, you can also see some writing on the key battery there. And that is the way that has to go back in. So just remember that you've got writing there, you've got writing there, and you've got nothing on the back really. Okay, nothing of any importance. Okay, so pop this uh, battery is a 2032 okay so use something decent okay we've got uh, Maxell 2032 but you can use Everready or Duracell or whatever you fancy but just get something decent and then pop that back in there nice and easy and then when you put it back together you've got a little hook here this end hooks back into the key so it'll be this end of the key all right so Slide, place that in there, hook it under, and push it down. And you know it's right because this surface here will be just about flat with the rest of it. It's not perfect, but as long as it's close, that's fair enough. That's good enough. And then, okay, so once your battery holder's back in, pop your screwdriver back in, give it a little twist. Hope you can see that. It's a bit tricky when you're trying to film things. Back to the lock position. And there you go. So that's how easy it is. So with a three button Alfa Romeo flip key, you are good to go.